Splurge versus Steel. Today I'm going to show you some of the key items for summer at a price that fits your budget. Hi, this is Netta. Welcome to my channel. My whole goal for this channel is to help you build a wardrobe and a style that you love so you look beautiful and feel confident every single day. I feel like the camera is moving a little. Maybe if I move my head like this, nobody will notice. Um, okay, today I'm excited to talk about splurges versus steals. And basically, how you can update your wardrobe for summer, some of the key pieces for summer at a price that fits your budget. Because we're all different places budget-wise, and I firmly believe that no matter what your budget is, you deserve to look and feel beautiful and to wear clothes that make you feel contemporary and modern and help you elevate your everyday summer style. So that's what this video is about. If that's something you're interested in. Definitely don't forget to hit the like button on this video before you leave let me know if you want to see more splurge versus steel videos okay the first item I want to talk about is the sandal that everyone is talking about all the time we're seeing it on everything it's basically a flat form espadrille sandal in brown this is in every outfit on every Instagrammer on every Pinterest picture from 2022 it's this these shoes and you know a, a, some version of this shoe and it's come you know it's it's a there's a good reason why it's popular it's comfortable it's very versatile it gives you height without giving you height like it doesn't feel like you're wearing a heel but it does give you height and it's super summery and, and it's just a little bit of a fresh take on a summertime sandal so I have two options here for you, just like I do for all these categories. The first one is from C by Chloe. This They call this their flat espadrille. It's $280. This is a premium version. You can see some of the details on it that are a little bit more elevated. There are a couple of different um, uh, colors of leather. So you've got a couple of different neutrals going on. Then in addition to the espadrille sole, it's got a thin brown kind of rubber wedge sole, and then it's got a thicker white sole. So it's going to be really comfortable. It's going to offer you some real traction, real support, and um, just be a really comfortable and long lasting shoe. Now, Amazon has a version of espadrille sandals for $25.99. All of these items, by the way, are going to be linked in my catalog in the description box below. So these are very similar. They have the ankle strap. They have the wide brown strap that covers the foot. Um, then they also have that espadrille heel, that raffia heel, and then a white foam or white rubber sole below the raffia heel, which is great because it kind of makes the shoes last a little bit longer. Like I said, it gives you a little extra spring in your step. And so that's a great detail to have. So $25.99 for the Amazon version, $280 for the C by Chloe version. Let me know in the comments below which is your favorite. Okay. I know I live in Florida and we don't often have an opportunity to wear even a summertime sweater, but when I go up to Illinois or when I go up to North Carolina, like I'll be doing this summer when I went to Scotland, a nice lightweight summery sweater is a great basic. And if it gets cool where you're, you are at night, you're going to want a light summery sweater. Um, an open weave uh, cotton or crochet sweater is a great staple to have for summer. This one is from Old Navy. It's $39.99. It's often on sale, but it's just a really wide open weave cotton sweater that you can layer over a tank. You can layer it over a bathing suit top, um, any kind of strappy top, and it's just a nice layer. This uh, next sweater is from a brand called Spiritual Gangster. This is their cotton crochet sweater. It's $128 and it's got a little bit more of an interesting weave. There's a little bit more going on. It's also a little bit of a tighter weave, so a little bit less bare, but it's a nice option that's also a cotton crochet sweater. Um, and I think it's a beautiful, um, beautiful style. So if you're looking for that summery sweater, you've got two options, one at around $40, one at hundred and almost $130. Okay, now another summertime essential is a white linen button-down shirt. Um, it's just such a great basic. You can put it over a bathing suit. You can put it, you can wear it with shorts. You can wear it with jeans. You can wear it over a, a strappy dress. You can wear it as a jacket. You can wear it as a top, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So I love Quince. The website for Quince is onequince.com. They feature really luxur luxurious essentials and natural fibers like linen, like leather, like cotton, like silk at really reasonable prices. So this is their linen button-down shirt for $39.90. So you can't beat that for pure linen button-down shirt. I absolutely love that. 
Now, kind of the gold standard for linen shirts is the Eileen shirt from Frank and Eileen. It's just such a well-made, perennial, seasonless favorite that, that women you know wear year after year after year. It's $248, it's made of pure Irish linen with beautiful finishing touches and details, and it's just definitely a premium linen shirt. So you've got a $40 version from Quince, and you've got a $250 version from Frank and Eileen. Okay, another summertime staple, something, and actually seasonless staple, something that showed up a lot in my 50 outfit, uh, 50 summer outfits over 40 video, is a pair of wide leg neutral trousers or just a pair of classic neutral trousers that are not, that are not fitted, you know, just the trouser style. Um, these Vince trousers are beautiful and elegant. They're a lovely cream color. They have got a high waist belt detail, you know, like a belt loop area, um, pleated front, uh, kind of a relaxed fit through the leg. They are 395. So beautiful premium pair of tailored dress pants. Now, if you want a less expensive version, but you want that same look, these high-waisted trousers for $35 from a site that I have fallen in love with called The Commence. So it's almost like common sense, but put together, C-O-M-M-E-N-S-E. -M -M -E. So Commence does a sustainable and affordable takes on some of the season's key looks. So they have dresses that look very similar to Reformation. They have dresses that look, you know, very similar to uh, Faithful, the brand, and any of the other contemporary brands that you're looking at, at a fraction of the price. They are also sustainably made and really, really good quality. So I really like the Commence. Um, so definitely a site to check out. Like I said, everything is linked below. So these are $35 versus $3.95. Okay, a crochet dress. This is a little bit of a tricky trend. Not everybody's going to fall in love with the, the crochet dress trend. I really like the summer salts version. It's $135. It's got a high neck and is sleeveless, and I feel like it's a nice tight weave. I feel like it's a little bit of an easier crochet dress to wear. It comes in black as well, so I think that's a really nice version. But the two that I wanted to compare, one is from BB Dakota, and it's um, available at Zappos. It's $128.95, and it's kind of lined where it needs to be lined, and then the bottom half from the mid-thigh on is kind of sheer, so you can see that crochet detail. So very, very pretty, um, easy kind of crochet dress. So if you're looking for a crochet dress, if that's something that's on your radar, this is a nice version of it. Now, if you wanna pay a third of that price, there's an H&M version for about $40. Um, again, similar style where it's sleeveless, it's neutral, it's lined through the mid thigh, and then it's sheer below that. So I definitely love that. Now, one of the styles that has been a really big um, sign of Farm Rio's clothes lately. They have done a lot of these asymmetrical dresses with these fringe detail on them. You know Farm Rio is one of my favorite premium kind of contemporary brands. Um, they're very, very well known for their kind of over the top and fun and playful prints and silhouettes and details that are very, very interesting. So this is their Macaw print dress. It's 275. It is beautiful. It's got an asymmetric, so it's one shoulder and then an asymmetric hem with the fringe detail. Just absolutely beautiful. I've also seen that fringe detail on a couple of other dresses of theirs on like Nordstrom and Neiman Marcus, and I just absolutely love that dress. Now, of course, Shein had to come up with its own version, and it's $12. Now, you will notice these are not the same dress, but it is definitely inspired by the Farm Rio dress. You know that the quality of this is not gonna be the same, you know the fit is not gonna be the same, you know the pattern is not nearly as sophisticated, but if you wanna try a colorful, fun, fringe dress for summer and you don't wanna spend 275, this $12 I still can't believe I'm suggesting something for $12 because it doesn't even seem possible. Um, I, I might have to order that dress just so we can see exactly what this looks like. I'm sure it's very thin and, and, and you know, not great quality, but it's $12. So if you want for a fun event, you're going to like a fun themed party and you just want to wear a fun dress for a night or, you know, you want something that you're just going to wear a couple of times this summer, $12, you just can't beat that. Okay, floral midi skirt with a slit up the front. It's just been a ubiquitous thing for the last couple of years. It's just such a staple. And Reformation is really, in my, my opinion, kind of one of the brands that started it all. They're very known for, their, um, for that style, both in a dress and in a skirt. This is their Zoe side slit skirt for 148. Um, it's a subtle, soft floral pattern in that 
midi flowy style with the the slit up the front now um H&M has their own version, this viscose skirt in a floral print, not as subtle, not as sophisticated of a floral print, but it's still the same silhouette, um, like a flowy midi skirt with a slit up the front. So very easy and effortless look for summer. Okay, the next skirt that I wanna feature is like a, a linen prairie or peasant style skirt, just a, just a soft flowy summertime skirt. This is a very quintessential and very uh, classic summertime staple and so we've got two different versions of it here um, there's one from Staud 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 S-T-A-U-D it's their tiered stretch cotton maxi skirt it's 225 at Nordstrom a um, beautiful navy tiered cotton maxi skirt with a little bit of stretch to it so I love that um, if you're looking for a less expensive one also from Nordstrom it's their treasure and bond tiered linen blend skirt also in navy for $59 so you've got a $225 version you have a $59 version for a very classic summertime skirt I believe loft also has a version of this so I'll link that also in the catalog that's in the description box below okay my final item is that braided top leather two strap sandal that is just everywhere 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 um, we have a couple of versions of these so the first pair is the paley braided sandal from dolce vita it's 125 dollars it's that neutral braided leather two strap sandal with a block heel um, very uh, very now ubiquitous but very versatile very easy summer staple to style now new day from target has their own version they call them the basil heels they're 34.99 they look very similar to the dolce vita pair that's 125 dollars so 125 dollars versus 35 dollars um you make you make that distinction or that decision for yourself and decide what fits your budget what fits your lifestyle how often you think you're going to be wearing these pieces how many seasons you're going to be wearing them if you know if this is if this is one of those really trendy items that for you you're only going to wear for a short period of time maybe you don't invest as much in it or if this is going to be a staple in your wardrobe maybe you decide that you're going to spend on the higher end for this these items so let me know what you think of these items and splurges versus steals i really um I really love doing these types of videos. One more before I go that I almost forgot about. There is another site similar to the Commence called Few Moda, F-E-W Moda. It's a membership site. I think it's like $39 for a quarter, but when you buy a membership, you get these clothes that are made at the same manufacturers as some of the really high-end contemporary brands like Faithful, like Revolve, like, uh, I mean, like, sorry, like Reformation, like the brands that are available at Revolve, but they're at a fraction of the price. So um, they have, and they tell you which factory this was made at and what other brand makes dresses at the same factory. So I love this white um, summery midi dress from Few Moda. I think it's beautiful at $60, a great price for a really nice quality dress. It's made at the same factory as Faithful, the brand, which is a contemporary brand that I've mentioned many times. It's a great contemporary brand. Their version of this dress, I'll pop that up here, is $209. So it's a $60 dress versus a $209 dress. And you're getting a very similar look. So definitely check out Fumoda. Again, it's a membership site. The Commence is not a membership site. And I'm going to link all of this information in both the blog post and the description box below. So now I'm done with my wrap up. That was the last item. Let me know what you think of the splurge versus steel. Whether you'd like to see more like this in the future. Um, what items are on your summer shopping list and um, what, what are you willing to pay for them? What price point are you looking to spend maybe i can help you find something um, to check off your list and um, definitely hit the like button if you like this kind of video hit the subscribe button if you have not subscribed already and the notification bell i upload new videos every tuesday and every friday love you guys and i'll see you in the next video